The following video is a collaboration between the Veterinary Channel and Griffin Poultry. In this presentation we are going to show footage of how to take blood samples from chicken using the brachial vein. We begin the video by briefly giving you some talking point about the circulatory system of chickens. Then we are going to show you footage courtesy of Griffin Poultry about how to take a blood sample using the brachial vein of several chickens. This video can serve as a practical review for veterinary students studying for their certifications. This video is not recommended for people less than 16 years old. We encourage our viewers to visit Griffin Poultry in YouTube to learn more about the fascinating world of poultry farms. In chickens, as in mammals, the driving force behind the circulatory system is a four-chambered heart that consists of a right atrium, right ventricle, left atrium, and left ventricle. The right side of the heart is smaller and less muscular pumping blood only to the lungs. The left side is larger, and it has well-developed muscles that pump blood to the rest of the body. The heart is located in the cranial portion of the thoraco-abdominal space. It is enclosed by a thin, fibrous pericardial sac, which contains fluid that aids in the lubrication of the heart muscle. This sac adheres to several internal surfaces to keep the heart anchored in place. The heart is supported by a group of vessels that provide channels for the passage of blood. Arteries carry oxygenated blood from the heart to the tissues, and veins carry blood containing metabolic waste products away from the tissue and back to the heart. Capillaries are small blood vessels in which the exchange of gases and nutrients occurs. Blood samples are taken for a variety of diagnostic purposes in chickens. In birds, Blood samples can be drawn most easily from one of three vessels, the jugular vein, the brachial vein, or a medial metatarsal vein. The jugular veins are located ventrally, on each side of the trachea. The right jugular vein is larger than the left and is most commonly used for venipuncture and cytosines. The brachial vein is located on the ventral side of the wing, extending over the elbow and up the humerus. About halfway up the humerus, it joins the cutaneous ulnar vein and increases slightly in size. In raptors, the brachial vein is often used to take blood samples or insert temporary catheters for repeated intravenous treatments. The medial metatarsal vein is located on the ventral medial side of the leg, extending from the metatarsal dorsally over the heel joint. Blood samples are sometimes taken from this site in raptors, but it is more commonly used for waterfowl species. The following footage shows a veterinarian at Griffin Farms taking blood samples from the brachial vein of several chickens. As mentioned before, viewers' discretion is advised. Kerana cakar dengan suruh kita ni, kita kau ni, bor kiri, mesti di kerja ini. Cakar lah. Thank you. 
कितने गए हैं बाकी चार पंच सात The Veterinary Channel wants to express special thanks to Shua Al Kamar and Griffin Poultry for their collaboration in the production of this video. We encourage the followers of the Veterinary Channel to visit and subscribe to Griffin Poultry in YouTube. This video has been optimized for the following phrases. How to take blood samples from chicken using the brachial vein. Taking blood samples from chickens. Taking blood sample from chickens using the brachial vein. Using the brachial vein to take blood samples from chickens. The chicken heart. Chicken arteries. Chicken veins. Chicken jugular vein. Chicken medial metatarsal vein. Chicken Brachial Vein Veterinary Channel Griffin Poultry Taking blood samples from chickens using the brachial vein is discussed in this video. Using the brachial vein to take blood samples from chicken is commonly done at Griffin Poultry Farms. The chicken heart is divided into the left atrium, right atrium, left ventricle, and right ventricle. The right side of the chicken heart pumps blood into the lungs. The left side of the chicken heart pumps blood to the body. The pericardial sac covers the chicken heart. The chicken heart is located in the thoracoabdominal space. The arteries transport oxygenated blood from the chicken heart to the tissues. The veins transport metabolic waste from the tissues to the chicken heart. The jugular vein can be used to take blood samples from chickens. The medial metatarsal vein can also be used to draw blood samples in chickens. This video shows you how to take blood samples from chickens using the brachial vein. The video is a collaboration between the Veterinary Channel and Griffin Poultry.